Hello, buddy. My name is Mr. Bonesy, and welcome to Slender Return to Rosewood Park. Or Rosswood Park. Um, so, the description of this is apparently it's saying it's based on Marlboro Hornets. Which, I haven't heard that in such a long time. If you don't know what it is, I would recommend you searching it up if you want to have the spook, I guess. It's basically, and I like to say, the origin story of Slenderman. Because it was pretty much... People making a movie that was like f five minute little short creepy like handheld movies people made together as a group and it's a little goofy and a little silly but it's basically the origin story of Slenderman. I think it was like the idea of like where the pages came from and collecting the pages. I think that's where it like inspired came from like from Marvel Hornets. I don't know what this game's gonna do or bring. Of course it's Slenderman so I'm expecting to collect eight pages and run away from tall, scary man in suit and tie. But, um, let's play. But since it's inspired, I'm not sure if it's going to be, like, references. I'm not even sure if the park is a reference to, like, one of the things. Because I haven't seen Marble Hornets in such a long time that it's new to me. Reopen now! I need, re I need to rewatch Marble Hornets. It's been such a... This is like decades, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> I don't know if this is like actually recorded just for this game. I could believe like, cause like the reason why I'm saying that is cause I could generally believe they like, oh, they clipped this from some shots from the actual videos that they recorded. That, okay, I don't remember that. I just know that there was like a spinoff chan YouTube channels just for that movie. Supposed to go in depth about the masks people and like their perspectives, quote unquote. And it was just like crazy, like insane videos. It's hard, it's weird describing it, but if you watched it, you would understand. VHS. Wonder if Slenderman was in that forest we were looking at. I don't know. This is like two months ago, I think, this game. So it's actually pretty recent. I just never heard about it or seen any anything about it. Oh! That looks scarily realistic. Are you shitting my nuts? <laughs> Flashlight focus? I can't even tell what's real or not that oh this looks really good i know ray tracing was an option in the options and i was like i don't think my pc could handle ray tracing i never done it before i'd rather not experiment a random game jolt game which by the way link in the description I, before i forget to say it collect eight pages this is the scariest shit in my whole life my god Nice. It's a map thing. Oh. Oh, why is there like weird trees like that? The sensitivity is a bit weird. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Man, I couldn't even beat the original Slender Man game. And that one I would consider is not even that scary. It's just the atmosphere that brings this creepy. But at least I'm not going to somewhat see ahead of me. Don't do that VHS camera feedback thing. Don't you dare glitch out on me like that. You're gonna make me think of looking at the guy. Guess I'll walk around this giant silo. See if there's a page. That is the strat with Slenderman, right? Just check every little thing that looks like a landmark. It does have a page. How do I grab things? Le left. Okay, left mouse button. Page one. Okay. Gotta get my hair out of my eyes. I usually don't... It doesn't usually bother my sight, but when you're having a strain of hair in your eyes and then tall grass, and then you're supposed to see something in the dark, not it does not combine well. But, like, I'm too focused with my hands on the keyboard and mouse that I don't want to actually brush it to the side, so I'm just letting gravity do the work. I'm actually kind of terrified. But at the same time, it's like seeing an old friend. I haven't seen Slenderman in such a while. That honestly, he probably won't remember me. It's been so long since I played a lot of his games. Is that a page or was that his fa- That's a page. Page two, Cohen. 
Page two inbound. There better not be some bullshit where he just teleports in front of you. I know the first Slenderman game did that. Hell, a few Slenderman games I played did that. That's a trash can I'm seeing. In the distance, right? I don't like the implications that there's a H to hide. I'm... Yeah, I'll hide the... You guys can't see it, but I'll hide it from my eyes. There was like the tutorial tips where my body's at. It, I don't like the implications of like the zoom in and zoom out feature. That scares me a little bit, if I had to be kind of honest with you guys. Page? Page. Oh, these are the four walls. Wow. Page three. The fuck are these dead trees, by the way? They're scary as fuck. I'll just keep going. God, I hate how realistic this looks. Like, of course, it's not like, oh, I can't tell which is real. But, like, it looks good. It generally looks terrifying. Like, hell, the, 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 cruel, it would be a cruel joke. But, like, what if Slitherman wasn't even in here? It was just me in the forest collecting paint. That would be, like, put me on edge for the entire journey. That's a sign. I thought that was a page, but that's just, like, a warning sign. There's a car. I can... Like, go off the brute path. Okay. That's a police car. With no page on it. Well, I don't like how I could just... Go off the route. Or go off the path and just look at that. There has to be a page on you. Deadass? Oh, I guess po guess police officers don't care about pages. I honestly thought I saw was looking at him because how oh, the VHS glitched out. Okay, I wasted some time. Slenderman doesn't like people wasting time, if I remember correctly. He uh, hates that stuff. He's not a patient person, I would say. Which, to his credit, I'll give him that. I am invading his... Pr uh, oh my god, the tunnel. I hate that tunnel. I hate the look of this tunnel. Why is it so big? Okay. Well, going into the fucking... Creepiest tunnel I've ever been into. There's a page. Expected, honestly, but... Once again, scary. I'm not even sure, but I want to ask this. In the original Slenderman game, I remember there's some landmarks, but some of landmarks don't even have pages. Did the game actually have, like, RNG with, like, locations? Like, do they actually... What the fuck? Oh, my God, that scared me. I think that's a trash bin. Yeah. I saw that glow, and I was like... <gasps> but was there, like, actual RNG with places like that? Like, oh, the silo w w won't always have a page. Don't tell me that's a building. Because I'm seeing that light in the distance. Oh, no. Do I really want to walk into a building? Oh, no. Oh, that's not even a door. That was like a vending machine. Oh! Okay. If there's a page in there, I'll fucking sacrifice it. Like, God only knows if I'm actually going to get all these pages. Dude, half the, I don't even finish half the Slenderman games I play sometimes. The Slenderman games are kind of like... Like, I make fun of Slenderman for not being patient. For I myself do not have the patience to sit through another gathering of eight pages. Because gathering eight pages again kind of sucks, if I have to be honest with you. I will, however, check this out. But I did see Slenderman. Page... Let's go. Five. Five pages. I just need three more pages. Wow, I gotta be honest. And I don't want to jinx myself. Slenderman, you're pretty tame. Maybe you don't hate me as bad. Then again, I did see someone say the ending was confusing. Which makes me kind of scared that there's going to be more after collecting the eighth page. Which would make sense because this game looks like it would have more rather than just collecting eight pages. Also, this game was like full on for like full screen, which... 
I'm not saying anything about it. Like, I'm not, that's not a complaint. It's just kind of an upset because I don't like turning on my second monitor because it's not compatible with my PC. So, like, it doesn't show the actual colors on the PC. Sounds confusing. And it was confusing to me when I discovered the problem. So, like, it's like a shade of blue. If people, people who know PC stuff will be like, oh, I know what you're talking about. I don't. So, for me personally, I didn't understand it. I had to call someone about it. They just told me, oh, it's not compatible to your thing. And I'm like, oh, that's upsetting. So, like, I don't like using my second monitor, especially since it's also tiny. It's a tiny second monitor. It's, a, it's like a very cheap. So, it was very tiny. And I only got it just for, like, these types of games because I know not every single game I play, I can window. But I like to see OBS in the background. So, I don't like, because I don't like leaving it up to just, like, like hoping it working is fine. Stop doing that VHS handheld thing. Freaking me out. This is like a path, I think. Yeah, this works as a path. I just pray I don't go in circles. Holy shit, I made it back. That's a... Uh, I'm at the start. You know what? I'll go this way then. What other landmarks have I not came across? I know there's tree logs. Or like how I always like to think of them. Like the Herobrine trees. Where like people were scared of Herobrine. And because Minecraft world generation was weird. And sometimes leaves didn't spawn on the trees. So it's just a bunch of stumps. And there was also like a van. If I remember. Which I think I'm coming across the van right now. Oh wait is this the. No this is a different police car. I was going to say. Is this, is this another house I have to enter? Or is this a house I could view? Then there are a house I can enter. What? Uh, be, uh, be there in a second, sir. The fuck was that about? <gasps> oh my god, I was staring at him without realizing it. Sorry to enter your fucking cubicles, Mr. Slender. Holy shit. Um, my bad. Did I not know that was his business? Okay. I didn't see a page in there. And I don't know if there was more to explore inside that building. I hope it wasn't just on one of the sides of the building. That would suck. I just need three pages. I know one of them was in that fucking bathroom. If it has, if it comes down to it, that'll be like the last place I'll check. Even though that's... Oh, the, the, every time there's a building map... Or building location. That's usually the first place to look into. Since you're not in danger yet. I will keep going forward. I would go right, but I'm scared I'll just come across the other landmarks I already discovered. Did my screen go staticky for a second? Am I staring at him without realizing it? I don't see him. What am I going? What am I coming up to right now? Oh, the cargo crates. Is that what it is? I forgot that was a landmark. That does not look like cargo crates. That looks like a... F oh, it's a truck. <laughs> I was wondering what the fuck this was. I'm in... Sorry? The man's behind me. Man, I'm having no luck with these locations I'm finding. Or landmarks, quote-unquote. I would put, like, my hands and do, like, the little two, uh, bunny ears going up and down. But I got, I'm too, like, laser focused on not letting go of my keyboard and mouse. I keep seeing that. Fucking so I'm back at this building, which, honestly, it's probably good that I came back so I can check it up again. Because, like, serious? There's, like, nothing here? It's, like, very cool landmark, too. And there's just nothing? I, once again, don't know if you can open doors. It's not really a door you could open, though. <gasps> Dead ass? There's a page on the back of it. Wow. That's really, like, pay attention to this, pay attention to this. Sucks. Wow, why, why was there just a page back there? Also, like, giant rock. I would check that, but there's no... Oh. These are the dead trees. 
That was a landmark? I guess it was. I'm guessing I looked at his face. There's a lot of dead trees. That's the tunnel. This is the other building. You know what? I'll look around this building too. I kind of forgot this existed. If I had to be honest. Oh, this is a prime place for Paige. No Paige. I really don't want to walk in there. <gasps> Dead ass. There was a page in there and I just missed it. Okay, I just need one more page now. You know where that's probably in? Those buildings. And surprisingly, this is exactly where I wanted to enter in from. I guess. This fucking sucks, by the way. Just being in here. At least it's not as bad as a dead end as I thought it was. Okay. Holy fuck. I got a good look at his ass. Well, if I remember anything, he was literally just... What if it's on this vending machine this whole time? Wouldn't that be comical? Okay. Definitely in the bathroom stalls then. Holy fuck. I swear if I check any of these restrooms and they're not in any of them, I'm gonna be pissed off. Like, where would it be at then? Okay. Just gonna go the long way around. Be in these thought lo <gasps> Escape? Where the fuck do I escape to? I I saw like a police car. There's like so much shit. Oh, I ran out of stamina, by the way. Well, this music fucking tearing the, scared the shit out of me, honestly. And I ran out of stamina. Running. Where to? Who fucking knows? I ran out of stamina. I didn't really see a fucking escape plan. Well, I did get all eight pages. So I can at least be proud of that. I hate the fucking sounds though.
I'm actually not knowing where to go. <laughs> I lost the path and I don't want to turn around. So I'll make my path. I'm getting actual panic. I'm panicking real bad. I don't like the fucking screaming in the soundtrack. Where do I go to? I could see why they, someone said the ending was confusing. Because you can't just say escape. Like where to, motherfucker? Over here? Ha! Huh! I fucking found it! What? That's crazy! I went like an off path and I found it. Legitly, like I took a speedrun strat. <gasps> What? Voice acting? What, what, what voice acting? I didn't see shit about voice acting. Except for the yeah and the music, but like other than that, voice acting. That's probably just for the music, because honestly, unless there's like secrets to this game. I, I beat it. Honestly, when I sat down and downloaded this, I was thinking, I'll probably do my best getting like a few attempts in these eight pages, but I don't, I don't do good in Slenderman games. So I didn't think hard, like much about it. Oh, now I want to die. Give me a second. I'll fuck- I'll die real quick. I want to see his jump scare. Oh, yeah, this would be the fence, right? Because, like, that's how they- I didn't even notice it because I didn't know what I was looking at first. I literally just- Yeah! Oh my god, I really did just kind of lucked out. Oh, the voice acting is the girl breathing when she's out of breath. Duh. Oh my fucking god. There he is. Yo, you look cool. You look so... That was cool. I like how the character died and actually kept trying to look at him or something. That was cool. This was cool. Oh man, I once I need to rewatch Marble Hornets to get because I don't think they had like an area like that. Of course, that like I mean that was like a student film or whatever. So it's like of course they didn't have the budget. They just went into a random forest. So I hardly doubt they actually had a park that was like similar in the. Sl I would be actually amazed if that was actually the origin of the park. It was just actually based on a real life area location. But that doesn't make sense. Why would there be like a bathroom and then a weird silo randomly somewhere? I don't know. But that was cool. And I'm actually really impressed that I beat this. <laughs> like, I gotta, I gotta pat myself on the back on that one. But, um, yeah, that was Slender Return to Rosswood Park. And, uh, in the future, Slenderman The Arrival will get its update, surprisingly. Since it, you know, hasn't been touched in, in like, 10 years. I think it's a 10-year anniversary update. And I'll play that when it comes out. I'll do another whole Let's Play on it. But this was really cool. I actually really like how it turned out. I like the way it looks. It's really creepy, I would say. It could be a bit harder, I would say. But then again, if it was a bit harder, I feel like it will be a little more... I don't know. I, I can't really say much. I The only thing I disliked was that one page that was just like... You see like that police car in the upstairs area of that building? And then the page is like outside of the fence. That was a bit annoying. Like, come on. It's like not... That was like a bull like that was stupid like i probably would have saw it if it was like my first page because i could have freedom of looking around but the fact that i had to go up a staircase and then look around i thought there was something up there so the fact that I was just there was kind of annoying but everything else was pretty cool um most of the f things is just me sucking like not seeing the page in that one building and too scared to go into the actual bathrooms but other than that everything's pretty cool and went pretty well um yeah, I can't really say much. I can't really think of complaints. Everything else is just Slenderman stuff. Like running, having exhaustion, and flashlight. Although I am glad the flashlight never died. died, Because I know in the first Slenderman game, it just dies. I'm rambling now. So I should wrap this up. <laughs> but um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya!